Welcome to this channel. This channel is for education and culture based on historical and scientific evidence. So in the past two weeks, I tried to share as much on the truth of Wing Chun to those who like to really know what is the truth of Wing Chun. And uh, due to that, there are two discussions uh, exist because our Wing Chun friends and martial arts friends uh, has been messaged me or comment on what I share. The first thing is on Wing Chun is an art of simplicity. So like this in the chat GPT, you can take a snapshot and uh, on the simplicity, okay? Another one is uh, like uh, over here on Wing Chun situation today is like this. Sure, karate has more than one style like traditional Chinese martial art, but they don't put down each other as many grand something do. My lineage, your lineage, this secret, that secret, 20 types of Siu Lim Tao, 30 types of Cham Kyu, ECT, ECT. So when you practice karate, BJJ, Western boxing, they are what they are. When you approach Wing Chun or Wing Chun or Wing Chun and so on, you never know what is in the box or maybe you know a crap. So I'm going to share with you on this simplicity and this stuff. So let's go on this first. You know, since... Since many, many decades ago, like early 1900, people have questioning Wing Chun. For example, in this uh, article, questioning Wing Chun, saying that Wing Chun is uh, an unauthentic uh, Wang Chun. Wang Chun means eternal spring. Wing Chun meaning praise spring, right? You know, so Wang Chun is Shaolin Wang Chun. And then uh, questioning this uh, Leong Zhan. Okay, so this is decades, decades ago. People questioning what Wing Chun is. Now, so what you can see is Prior to uh, Grandmaster Yip Man pass away, he actually uh, make an address, make an announcement in his interview, said, Eternal Spring is not Prey Spring. Wing Chun is not Shaolin Wang Chun. So, Grandmaster Yip Man stood up for Wing Chun, for Praise Spring. Well, at that time, 1973, he is he. You don't have all this Bruce Lee stuff like today. So no matter what, he stood up for Wing Chun. Of course, he know this. This is prior to this interview. So he wanted to clean it up. This is why I respect Grandmaster Yip Man. I'm not related whatever with him, but he stood up for Wing Chun. At that time, you look at him, he is poor. Okay? But he stood up. This is a Chinese, a Chinese who do not forget their ancestor. Now, after his passing, Grandmaster Yip Man passing, you have Bruce Lee here saying that Wing Chun is land swimming. You have people 
in Asia, writing books, questions on Wing Chun, questions on Yip Man. It is a right, straight questioning Wing Chun. And in the same time, questioning Yip Man, Grandmaster Yip Man. And then after that, you have uh, people making YouTube, okay, who is from Shaolin Wang Chun, is uh, questioning Yip Man and uh, speculate on Yip Man. And then even lately, recently, they speculate on Leong Zhan, they speculate on how is Eternal Spring, Shaolin Eternal Spring become today's uh, Wing Chun. Well, and of course, this is about six years ago, you have Xi Xiaodong in public saying openly that Wing Chun is for demonstrations. Wing Chun is not for fighting and this is no can do, there's no can do. You think, you think, if Grandmaster Yiman still today, will he buy that? All this sort of stuff. All this sort of stuff. Do you think he will buy it? If Grandmaster Iman is still alive today. I bet you with anything. With everything. Grandmaster Iman will not buying that. He will stood up. Clarify this thing. Okay. Now, however, you look at the Wing Chun people today. This is the era of me, 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 money, money, money. What did they do? Make movie like this. Okay. Continue on this type of technique stuff, and then continue on this chi sao stuff. Continue on this, heaven know what it is now. And then even worse. Right now, the Chinese uh, CCTV is uh, having this New Year program using state performance to present the essence of Wing Chun Kung Fu. Now, on this thing, this is in mainland China. I'm saying this, I probably will never can be admitted into Hong Kong or China anymore, but I want to say it. 100 years ago, Tang Hao and uh, Ma Li Tang and all those who fight the Japanese invasion, saying that we martial art Chinese Kung Fu <coughs> is not state performance. The, these people today <coughs> read about their Chinese history. Of course they don't. You see all of this nonsense your martial art be become dense. With all of this, that's why I say money, 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 me, me, me. Did anybody care for what is Wing Chun? That's why you, you turn into this. That's why you turn into this. My lineage, your lineage, and uh, there are so many grand something. Okay, this secret, that secret, all this stuff. So this is because it's in the era of me, 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 money, money, money. Do they care for Wing Chun? What is Wing Chun? Of course they don't. Did they follow what Grandmaster Yiman stood up for Wing Chun? Of course they don't. Now, you like it or not, this is in the history in the public domain in the history. This is in the book, public with the ISBN number, if I'm not wrong, in Asia. 
by uh, a, a, a so-called grandmaster of other star martial art. This is in the YouTube, this is in the YouTube and in China. This is in the YouTube and in China. So, instead, like uh, Grandmaster Yit Man stood up to clarify, to solve this problem, you need to solve this problem for Wing Chun, or else you don't have anything. But no, it is uh, the era of me, 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 uh, money, money, money. I'm the grandmaster. I make a lot of money. And you make keeping making movie using uh, Yip Man's name and then uh, all this kind of stuff. And now the Chinese in China even do this. Which is violating all whatever the real traditional Chinese martial arts is 100 years ago. So, where is your Wing Chun? So, after Grandmaster Yip Man, there is nobody who stood up for Wing Chun. I'm not saying that Grandmaster Yip Man is the ultimate or the perfect Superman, anything, or no, oh, no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that you can see that he have a love on the art he practiced. And now people allow this, the Bruce Lee stuff, this, uh, all this book and all this claim stuff from other people and see your own stuff to be exist there while they are doing whatever they like for their fame, for their name, for their money, for their whatever heck. Trashing Wing Chun. Okay? And now this is 2024, it becomes like that. So what is Wing Chun? If it's according to this, like uh, people who, who are going to study what is Wing Chun uh, 100 years later thing. Well, Wing Chun is just a movie, a performance, a fantasy food. That's what it is. So when people asking me all kind of problem questions sometimes, I say, why don't you just go face all these people first, solve the problem of, uh, of uh, Bruce Lee, solve the problem of this book, solve the problem of this claim on, on, on Yip Man, on Leong Zhan, on Wing Chun Wang Chun, and then solve the problem on the Xi Xiao Dong. Isn't Wing Chun supposed to do that? Or, or just continuing doing all those things and then uh, my lineage, your lineage, and then all this. They don't put down each other as many grandmasters do. They just learn how to put down each other, but they do not solve the problem. They don't even have the guts to stand up like a grandmaster yet man. Okay? So, it is really, really sad that all this problem, I have already solved it for you. Asia cannot solve it. I solve it in the United States. So, this to YouTube. Okay? This to YouTube. Is the answer to all of this, to 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 this. Based on what? Historical evidence, physics. Otherwise, you don't have Wing Chun, you have garbage. Okay. Why garbage? When people pull, uh, when people challenge you outside, you don't dare to say a thing, a words. But you put down each other. And you don't want to face reality. And keeping using this grandmaster name, that grandmaster name, 
But do you, I don't see anybody since Grandmaster Yip Man to stood up there to say the thing. Hey. So this is what my answer to this. This is an era of me, 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 money, money, money. Grandmaster Yip Man has already gone 50 years. And it is really sad that the Chinese, the Asian, cannot do the job that I have to do it in America. As an American Chinese, I have to do this in America. Or else, it is a disaster. I really wish somebody do this, not me. Okay? It's not my job. I don't have a school. I don't have a lineage. I don't, I just study. So here on, anybody who want to know the truth of Wing Chun, this is whatever is in the history. Okay? So, cut it off on those you put me down, I put you down, my lineage, blah, blah, blah. This is how Wing Chun is going to face the world, including Xi Xiao Dong. Because evidence and history and science speak. It's not who have the bigger feast. Or who is the best fighter or who is the king of what. Okay? People need to be educated properly. Not just using Wing Chun to, to make money and screw everybody. Well, sorry to say Wing Chun is not belong to you, not belong to your father. So if you want to do anything, do it with your name. Have guts like a, like a Bruce Lee. Do it with your name. Even those in the China. Stop to, to mess around with the real Chinese martial with all this performance stuff. Those just make people, make the Korean, the Japanese, the Okinawan, the Westerner laugh at you. Now, is Wing Chun a simply city art, like many believe? Well, of course, it is not. So I say stay away from this. Wing Chun equal to simplicity, energy, Tai Chi way, slow and soft. Anybody say this, that means simple-minded world, Kung Fu movie living in vacuum. Seriously, that's what it is. Wing Chun is never a simplicity act. I don't know who invented this. That's what I say again. If you want to invent something, say it. I say this. Like I put in this YouTube, my channel, I say this. Like here, debunk me, please like in the academic or university level, use this level of history, evidence, and physics, and science to debunk me. I'm open for anybody, entire world. Okay? So when you create something, stop to pushing what you don't know. Because that leads to people living in a simple-minded world, in a kung fu movie, or in living in a vacuum. Now, this is the era of really strange era for past 100 years. The Chinese, in the early 1900s, stopped using their classical language. After that, the Chinese don't understand their own Chinese language. And then you have a lot of uh, grandmaster uh, raised up in the Western, thinking that Tai Chi is the ultimate and they know it all. So the result is today is completely missing the point. It is a serious problem for Chinese Kung Fu and Wing Chun. I prove to you, 
the root, the root of Chinese Kung Fu is gone, wiped out because of the Chinese people don't understand Chinese. So most of the Chinese Kung Fu, not everyone, but most of the Chinese Kung Fu is wiped out because they're missing this point. They're missing the root. And the Westerner keep praying grandmaster of thinking Tai Chi, philosophy, Taoist, and know it all. So the result is completely missing the point. So here I put it in Chinese. This is a saying in the in in the in the Zen in the Buddha's teaching in China. Clueless teaching the clueless. Clueless teaching the clueless. One is teaching, but both are clueless. The teacher go to hell. Where do you think the student end up? This is exactly what it is. Okay? So what you end up is clueless teaching clueless. So you are Kung Fu, Chinese Kung Fu for 100, 100 years now. It, it, it become like this. Now, people today in the West like to thinking everything is a Tai Chi, Tai Chi, Tai Chi. So this is like this, this thing. This is a translation of uh, uh, Qi Qi Guang, General Qi Qi Guang, Quan Jing. And this person say this. The similarities between the Taiji and the Quanjing element point to possible common heritage. Taiji, like all martial arts, passed from teacher to student, verbal instruction, blah, blah, blah. And then uh, keeping Taiji and Dr. Sun Chu Yan was examining Taiji lineage. You know, this is nonsense. Why? You know what is truth? The truth is the Taiji people copying. Jenna Chi Chi Guang's classic, but they don't give credits. And later, Tang Hao and so forth found out that Chen Tai Chi's classic is actually based on the Chi Chi Guang. So you see, people have no idea on what is the Chinese Kung Fu what is Taiji and uh, and start to have all this uh, Ming Dynasty, Wang Zhongye. This is uh, Wang Zhongye is writing nonsense. Just read at the Abbey Tap and, and so forth, okay? So Wang Zhongye, Taiji and so forth, so forth. So th 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 this is the era. And how many people today is thinking that wow, Wing Chun has to be internal from Tai Chi? All those bullshit. And not knowing that, as why I, I, so I put it here, Wing Chun is from General Chi Chi Guang. And what is the truth of the 1850 Wing Chun is here? My evidence. Now, let me share with you. The Chinese people don't understand Chinese and the Westerner don't understand Chinese, but keeping have their own interpretations. And some thinking the, the ultimate is, uh, is uh, Tai Chi, which is a nonsense. So this is the art of war, Sun Tzu, the art of war. Thousand years uh, classic. Look at the... Uh, Look at the, uh, the, the translations. Over here, if you know the Chinese, you know exactly what it is. He said that the clever combatants make use of momentum. And look at what is the people uh, translate. The clever combatant look to the effect of combined energy. What the heck it is? Shi here exactly mean momentum momentum 
physics in physics momentum. And here the person have no idea what is this si mean, so it's keeping have this become energy. And here again he said when he utilize the combined energy. This is in Chinese, 认识者, it's just meaning that you make use of the momentum. And then here you say that, so the good fighter is using the momentum, like uh, the round stone uh, roll down from the cliff. Okay, so, so the, the, the proper exact translations or meaning is saying that the good fighter is using the momentum and the way how he used the momentum is the momentum is like the round stone rolling down from a mountain or a cliff. That is momentum. And this person, you look at all this uh, 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 translation in Sun Tzu and everything. It's like this. Thus, the energy developed by the good fighting man is as momentum of round stone roll down a mountain thousand of feet in high. So much on the subject of energy. This is exactly when people don't know Chinese language. It's like uh, when people say apple, because you don't know what is apple, you look at the apple and you say this is a fruit. A fruit look like apple. If you know apple, you eat it before, you taste it before, you know this is apple, you say, well, this is apple. But this person has no idea on what is a Kung Fu, Chinese martial art, what is the military uh, art of China, which is core in using of momentum. The Chinese specialty is using momentum. So, because people have no idea, both the Chinese and the Western have no idea what is a momentum, you end up everything Tai Chi, Tai Chi, and all everything, and then all those hand techniques and that, and, and, and that's why you end up like today, like you're living in a fantasy zone. Now, momentum. What Jen, uh, the Sun Tzu said is exactly, okay, you can go to uh, this, this channel, conceptual academic channel, Read about the momentum, like the round rock roll down from the hill. Okay. Round stone roll down a mountain thousand feet of height. It's exactly that. And there's inertial in, in, uh, in motions. Okay. And so there are momentum and inertial. Okay, so inertial is the resistance offered by a body to the motion, whereas momentum is the tendency of the body to continue moving. That is what exactly this thing, what is said in the in, in the in the Sun Tzu, the art of war. The Chinese uniqueness is using momentum. The reason I using this Sun Tzu. At a war is because the Chinese Kung Fu is inheriting this. So on momentum, you want to read this. You want to study this. What it is momentum. Okay, and this is momentum and inertia. Okay. Inertia of rest is the fundamental property processed by body to oppose any change of its rest. Or in other words, the body does not want to change its state or, re or of rest, but want to continue its state of rest. is called inertia, rest, static inertia. And there's a, uh, uh, if it is moving, it wants to continue to move. There's Newton's first law, the law of inertia. 
So the Chinese, thousands of years ago, is wanting to use this momentum. Okay? It's all here. You can take a snapshot. So what is momentum? Is your mass multiplied by your velocity. Go again to this concept academic to, to really study what is momentum. And then also the inputs. This is important. You talk about the Wing Chun inch power. This inputs, this uh, inputs and uh, momentum change equation, all this in the collusion is important. We will need to study this. Study this, study this, study this, study this, study this. Even though it is thousands of years ago, the Chinese don't have a Newton yet, sign yet, but they are talking that. So number one thing, sorry. Stop all this simple CD, uh, energy, Tai Chi way, slow and soft. Get rid of that. If you want to talk about fighting in Chinese Kung Fu. And uh, this is, uh, again, you know, in this uh, YouTube, talk about the collisions. If you want to generate the inch power and the collision and so forth, you need to study this. And actually, this is exactly, based on this, is exactly why Xi Xiaotong say that your Wing Chun doesn't work. Where is it? Yeah, on this one. What he say here, he critic on Wing Chun today, is actually based on physics and sport science. So you better listen and clean this up instead of going, doing all this heaven's sake, know what the heck is going on. Okay. So momentum. It's important. Why? Because <clears throat> in the Ming Dynasty at the Qi Qi Guang time, this is the translation, okay, in my book. I purposely translate it into this book. Because I know that I am really frustrated after I saw all translations of uh of the uh, Qi Qi Guang classic and so forth. That's why I translate it. The momentum of martial is the root of change. The momentum of martial consists of both guarding and opening po portion regardless of its upright, oblique, rising, sinking, all this. It's all momentum, momentum, momentum. This is a general Qi Qi Guang's. This is a translation. One always transform from one type of momentum to another type of momentum to defeat opponent. One momentum type could endlessly transform to other type of momentum. When the transform transformations of one type of momentum to the other type of momentum is unpredictable and subtle, and the opponent is unable to predict the trend of momentum transformation, that is named superb. So this is what Qi Ji Guang talk about Chinese Kung Fu. So you see, this is a martial art, Chinese martial arts, using momentum as the base. Momentum as the base. And the Chinese military art, warfare, using momentum as the base. They are one link. Forget about all those bullshit nonsense, uh, energy, energy, what energy? If you have no idea of what it is, stop to... No, find out what it is instead of this energy and then everybody uh, go, oh, Wing Chun is simply the energy, Tai Chi way, slow and soft. How the hell is one transport, one momentum transformed to another momentum simply CD? It is really complex. How many things you need to deal with in your body, your inner shell, your inner shell, your momentum, and... Uh, your, your, your collusion handling, your impulse handling. 
How, how is that simple? How is that Wing Chun simple? So, so this is the teaching of, uh, of, of Chinese Kung Fu, and this is the base of Wing Chun. This is the, uh, the, 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 in the classic of, uh, of uh, uh, Diana Chi Chi Guang. This shi momentum, this all momentum, and this is a combination. This is like a uh, flag and banner, a uh, banner and drum, drum and drum, banner and drum momentum. Left and right, you press in, okay? And then uh, horizontally, laterally, okay, left and right, press in, close to his hand, laterally, chop him and then all kinds of stuff and then you can fall him okay so it's, it's here it's in this book okay so the translation is here how to do it is here how that thing is performed is here. How from here shoot and then take down. So it is this thing. And uh, the translation is banner and drum momentum. Press and advance to the left or the right. Get close to the opponent and double chop. Everyone can identify the twist. Lean and take down. Hug the tail head has no escape. Translate to the, 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 the motion, motion, it is this. You go in, you get strike him, strike, and then you take down. If the opponent, why it, at this step, if the opponent get in, you go into another lock. So that's the combo of banner and drum momentum press, and advance to the left or the right, get close to opponent and double chop. Everyone can edit, identify the twist, lean, lean and take down, hug the tiger's head, has no escape. Is that simple? How can any combination momentum be simple? Why well, it continue to, to, to change, to change in the three-dimensional way? So, it is there. So, as uh, in general, Chi Chi Guang, I sum for you, it is a momentum play. Martial is a momentum play. You have a long fist, short strike, ground fighting, and you have all kind of combination like this one. This is your, 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 your Guan Sao. It's all with combinations. It's not just, oh, uh, I simply using this, uh, this, this bong sao, uh, this degree bong sao. No, it is the combinations. Okay. So you talk about momentum. You have to talk about how to handle your body, like like today's in the in the. Uh, in the sprinting, so I, I just, I, I just, I, I just, is is here, and when you talk about the Bruce Lee's inch power and the real inch power. The real inch power is not your structure and sun pun, sorry. It is this. It is based on the impact force is based on change of momentum and durations of collusion is this. Is this equation? Is this equations? 
is this equation, the change of momentum and inputs. Inputs, okay, is this equation. So the impact force is the change of momentum divided by the durations of collusion. You control the, 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 uh, the, the short, the durations. You have a short durations of the collusions. So it is impact force, it's leg body and arm generate change in momentum. It's not standing there with your structure and then waving your hand. So the Chinese know it 400 something years ago. This is Jenna Chi Ji Guang time. And that's why you need to have something called recycling of momentum because you have inertia. You have momentum, you have inertia. You need to know how to recycle it only that you can transform from one momentum to another momentum make use of the momentum and the inertia you're not standing there with a with, with a with a structure or you're waving your hand it, it is not that okay So, how is that simple? If, if you miss the, the, the momentum thing, all this thing, this physics stuff, it doesn't matter. It's Chinese 1,000 1, years ago, Chinese 150 years ago, <clears throat> on Newtonian physics, they're talking about the same thing. If you miss that, how are you going to do anything? Okay. So, so you, you look at this. Isn't this a combination? You, you look at this. Isn't this all momentum exchange combinations? Isn't this all momentum? Recycling momentum and all those stuff? Just look at this. Isn't isn't it? Isn't it is the combination stuff? All combinations. Now, you just look at this, like even this uh, in, in Chinese martial arts, in this you can see, start at Chi Chi Guang time, you have a ground fighting, short strike, long fist. This is the uh, ground fighting. Isn't it playing with momentum, combinations? This is a short strike. Isn't it combinations? So if you miss the momentum, you miss the inputs, you miss whatever I tell you just now on collision and everything, and, and you're keeping doing all those Tai Chi energy and everything, is it Chinese Kung Fu or some kinds of nonsense? Okay, how, how are you going to face the real world? How, how are you going to face this kind of stuff? H how are you going to face this kind of stuff? And besides, it, it is not, it's not, it's not Chinese Kung Fu. Chinese Kung Fu is uh, combinations, momentum combinations. So that is what is the bottom line of Chinese Kung Fu. If you miss that thing, 
and then you're going for this. You're going for this. It is just, oh my God, what are you doing? And not to mention, if you are a real Wing Chun fighter, you don't go doing this way, fighting this far away. You don't go do fighting this far away. You want to close in, okay? You don't fight this way. You don't fight, you don't fight this way. You don't. You, you get in, you get close. Your leg going in, you lock him with your leg while you snatch him. It never is like this. It never is like this. Fighting 10 billion miles away. Also, it never be like this. Standing there. That's not short strike. Okay? So, I don't even know what to say sometimes. And uh, also, the teaching of uh, General Chi Chi Guang Is this once you learn the skill you must test your skill on your opponent the goal of testing is to find out the cause and of winning or losing do not feel proud of your victory or shame of being defeat if you are afraid of your opponent then you still do not have the enough skill a good fighter certainly has a refined skill the ancient has said high level of skill support one's courage this is the truth you can trust it got nothing to do with I'm the king of Wing Chun, I'm the first fighter, I'm the blah, blah, blah. That's Kung Fu movie. The real world is like this. You're keeping training, you're keeping improve yourself. So, I really don't know what to say. If you say there's a Wing Chun still, I say there's no, there, I don't see Wing Chun. And in fact, most Chinese Kung Fu is gone. How many people talk about momentum? Just look around. How many people talk about momentum when they talk about Kung Fu? That's why I translate what General Chi Chi Guang is presenting and all those, the general of a Ming dynasty. That's why I translate to, to show what, what exactly is going on with Wing Chun, 1850. That's why I map thing into momentum. I map it into momentum. As far as I say, I put this in America. Am I going to make a lot of money? Of course not, right? What I want is this ISBN. Now, my video is in YouTube. All this is protected by ISBN. Copyright. That's the way how to keep the information for everybody. So this is what I'd like to share with you. I know my language is really strict. And I don't want to blame on people because this is the era of money, 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 me, me, me. People have less education, but keeping thinking for that. Did they love their, 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 their Chinese martial art? No. Did they love their Kung Fu? No. They just love themselves. They want the grandmaster. So usually people go train from this guy. And then after a while, say, hey, you know, this, 
my Chinese teacher don't know much too. So I want to be a grandmaster. I start my own organizations as a grandmaster. That's exactly what the Buddhists say. The clueless teaching the clueless. One is teaching both are clueless. And then the, the clueless student go out and, and, and become a grandmaster. And at the end, the entire Chinese culture collapsed. Because everybody is clueless. You want to talk about Chinese Kung Fu, the first thing you want to talk about momentum. I just shared with you just now. If you talk Chinese Kung Fu, Chinese military do not base on momentum, you are not talking Chinese Kung Fu. So don't give me the Tai Chi, Qi, or hand techniques. Nonsense. The Chinese Kung Fu for thousands of years is not like that. Now it becomes, as far as I say, do you have Wing Chun? No, you don't have Wing Chun. You have a movie fu. You have delusion fu. You have fantasy fu. You don't have Kung Fu. Why? Simple. Kung Fu based on momentum. From Sun Tzu, the art of war, to General Qi Qi Guang, to General Tang Sun Tzu, to General Yi Da Yu in the Ming Dynasty until 18, uh, uh, 1850s uh, in the Red Boat, Wing Chun and Tai Ching. Also the Chai Lei Fat, Hong Sing Chai Lei Fat, you see all those momentum. The dog style is all this momentum too. They are based on General Qi Qi Guang. So this is what I like to share with you. Stop to saying that Wing Chun is simply CD. And stop to use this grandmaster, that grandmaster. Yet I don't see one guy who is uh, have the gut to stand up saying, no, Wing Chun is not that way. This is the proof, like Grandmaster Yit Man. Okay? So learn from the, the real Grandmaster, like Grandmaster Yit Man. Do not just, just, just create whatever your story, but uh, you say, does Yit Man say? Does Yit Man say that? So I hope that what I share with you, this two point today, you put in your mind, you put in your heart if you want to learn Chinese Kung Fu and you want to learn uh, Wing Chun.